And vodka has launched in Minnesota, and it's got a very familiar face by. Yeah, you very much recognize Mark Parrish here from Northland Vodka joining us now. Thanks so much for coming in today. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. Yeah. So you're having a good time doing I, this? I, I am. <laughs> I, I'm enjoying finding the business world, or learning the business world mm -hmm. now after just playing a sport. You right. had a heck of a hockey career, mm -hmm. uh, and you retired when? Uh, 2012. 2012. Okay. So you were kind of enjoying retirement, and tell us the story of how you got involved with Northland. Well, w once you retire, all the bumps and bruises and the health starts to kick in a little bit yeah. more. And a friend of mine from high school actually came to me about 18 months ago and asked if I would be in, interested in starting a vodka because, well, he knew that was my drink of choice. Mm. <laughs> and and uh, I, I kind of got involved. In my, the one thing for me was one that's got to be very healthy. Mm -hmm. it, it's got to be clean, pure. So we got 100% organic corn vodka from Benson, non-GMO, gluten-free. We distill it at Copper Wing and we mm -hmm. filter it maybe a couple more times than my buddy wanted me to, but we wanted to make sure. <laughs> it's it like we're trying to make money here, Mark. Exactly. How many yeah. times do we have to filter this thing? I mean, this is a true Minnesota vodka, then. If you're a Copper Wing and you're down in Benson. Um, Copper Wing's in St. Louis Park. It's yeah. a small local yes. distillery. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. But they also do contract work, and that's yeah. they're, they're making your vodka. Yeah, right. right. absolutely. Uh, and part of it, too, is you told him, you know, I really want to be involved in this process in terms of tasting, in terms of making the kind of product that I want to be a part of. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I like the vodka thing, but it, ha it it's his brainchild. It's my baby. Mm -hmm. if that's kind of yeah. how we talk yeah. about it, right? So so we went through it, and uh, instantly, as soon as we started to talk about doing this and get this business going, is we need to give back. Uh, the spirit of hockey, give back to the group, give back to the grassroots that helps right. me get to where I was right. and we can help those young kids move So it along. says right on every bottle that you are dedicating at least 5% of the profits to community hockey programs. What does that mean? Uh, all over the state of Minnesota. And, and actually, we've, we've exceeded that already in the first couple months of just mm -hmm. being in business. Uh, our goal is to not say no to anyone that asks mm -hmm. for anything, <laughs> whether it's just a couple bottles, a signed hat, a T-shirt, right. whatever we can do. Uh, we just want to make sure that everybody understands we give back and we, we understand where I come from, and we're, I'm yeah. very thankful for that. I mean, you think of where you came out of the local hockey, uh, community hockey, youth hockey back then. Um, where can we find it? Haskell's, Top Ten Liquors, Cellars, Aces. Uh, it, we're getting more and more stores here and go, here and there. And just ask your local liquor store or uh, your local bar. Okay. What's been the hardest part about this for you? Uh, actually, having a nine-to-five job. <laughs> yeah. I, I have to You've make, never I have had to that. make no. phone calls. Right. I have to sell something. It's, it's, it's actually fun to kind of learn this business world when I was just kind of led upon by a leash my whole career. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you, does your name open doors for you? You think when you call people up? Uh, it, Some people probably don't know who you are. I hope so. Oh, absolutely. I, right. I, I hope so. Yeah. yeah. I hope yeah. so. That's you the goal. should have some credit but, for right. the the years that that you ever, that, you that your body yeah. at least in the hockey world, right? Right. Well, speaking of the hockey world, I do appreciate that throwback jersey there. Oh, <laughs> right? Grew up a North Stars right. fan. I know I played for a while, but North Stars. Now we know right. Chad Greenway has a vodka too. I mean, are all of the athletes going to have a vodka? And how much do you hate his vodka? Oh, not at all. <laughs> well, 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 at, least, at least Lieber mixed it up and went whiskey. <laughs> Lieber, <laughs> went, Lieber did go a different route. Yeah. Uh, well, I think it's great. It's a, it's a great product, so congratulations. Yeah. Thank yeah. you very Mark, much. Mark, thanks yeah. for coming in today. Monday